and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a quick video for you about the Temple of Kam Ambo. I'm just going to jump right into it and let's get started. Kam means mountain and Ambo means gold. So Kam Ambo means mountain of gold. Now this is the only temple in Egypt that was dedicated to two gods. You might have seen in my previous video that Edfu was a temple that had rooms for several gods, but this one only has two rooms and that is for Horus the Elder, not Horus the son of Isis, and Sobek the crocodile god. Sobek wanted to get rid of his brother from the village. However, everyone loved Horus the Elder and they decided to go with him and leave the village and follow him. But Sobek needed people to run the town and to farm, etc. So he went to the cemetery, planted the bones of the dead people, and grew more dead people. But these people weren't smart, you know, because they were dead. So instead of planting wheat or other crops, they planted gold. So now we have a mountain of gold, also known as Kam Ambo. Might, which is the god of justice, wanted to make a deal to stop the brothers from feuding, and so he made a temple for both of them. Both sides are equal. It is divided into both sides look the same, except one side has Horus and the other side has Sobek, the crocodile god. Once again, I just wanted to show you all the intricate details that are on all these columns and walls. It is absolutely stunning, especially when you see the scale of it when you're standing in there and you see how tall they are. It's just unreal. People would come from all over to this temple for healing and there are actually hieroglyphics of medical instruments on the walls, and they look quite similar to the ones that we use today. While you're enjoying this stunning artwork, don't forget to hit the like button because it helps me out a ton, and hit subscribe because I have some more Egypt vlogs coming, including Valley of the Kings, Abu Simbel, and Swimming in the Nile. You don't want to miss those. This is the Nileometer. It looks like a well, but really it was used to measure how high the Nile would flood every year. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to hit like and that subscribe button. See you next time.